Hi everybody, time for a book. I have Clara the Caterpillar. This is by Pamela Duncan Edwards and it's illustrated by Henry Cole. One day a cream colored butterfly laid an egg on a cabbage leaf. Grow up to be courageous and content, Clara, she called to her egg as the wind carried her. So she already had a name when she was laid as an egg. Clara lay curled in the egg case for a considerable time. Eventually, a crowd of caterpillars clustered around her. She's incredibly late coming out, commented one. She's very cautious, agreed the other. A curious caterpillar knocked on Clara's egg case. This is Cornelius, he said, come out. But I'm uncomfortable in here. I'm comfortable in here, called Clara. She's not uncomfortable, she was comfortable in her egg. She did not want to come out. Who cares if she comes out, scoffed a scowling caterpillar called Katisha. It's clear she'll only be a cabbage caterpillar. Cabbage caterpillars are so common. Don't be cruel, Katisha, Cornelia scolded. Cabbage caterpillars are cute. Look at, there was Catilia. She was, she looked, or Katisha. She looked a little snobbish. Did you say cabbage, cried Clara. Cabbage sounds scrumptious. So Clara cut a hole in her egg case and clambered out. Bus scene. The following buses are here. Join. I'm a lucky caterpillar, she said. Cornelius, come and share this delectable cabbage. Oh, she's inviting her friends to try. Clara and Cornelius climbed and crawled and capered about. They had carefree caterpillar fun. They crammed themselves with cabbage, carrot, and cauliflower leaves. They grew into colossal caterpillars. I think this book might be about C's. <laughs> then one day Cornelius called, Clara, come and make your chrysalis. Don't encourage her, mocked Katisha. She's only going to become a common cabbage butterfly. Why is Katisha being catty, Clara asked. Katisha is conceited, comforted Cornelius. She knows she'll become an attractive crimson colored butterfly. See, I said she was kind of snobbish. They're calling her conceited. Another C word. Then Clara, Cornelius, and the other caterpillars caught on to the cabbage, carrot, and cauliflower plants with cottony threads. They crinkled and discarded their skins and cuddled down inside their chrysalises. Just like the caterpillars we saw earlier today turning into. I'm crushed in here. And I hate being here picked and up. I'm cramped. I'm creased. I'm coiled like a corkscrew. I'm crumpled. My back tickles. This makes me cranky. I can't scratch. I can't cope, complained Katisha. Look at they're all complaining about being in their chrysalises. What in the world? Cooey, cried Cornelius to Clara. Are you comfortable? Actually, I'm very cozy, Clara called back. She's cozy. Look at the little rabbit watching them all. Then one morning, the chrysalises began to crack and out climbed delicate creatures. Cool, cried Clara. You all look captivating. Cornelius, you're a terrific copper color. Why, is that scruffy creature conversing with us? complained a scowling crimson colored butterfly. Katisha, Clara said, you are spectacular. Of course, replied Katisha. And you, Clara, are so cream. I think cream is cute, declared Cornelius. Cute, Katisha snickered. Don't be ridiculous, Cornelius. She really is not very nice. Then Katisha climbed towards the clouds on her scaly cobweb wings. Suddenly a crow cawed and scared everyone. Snack time, 
he exclaimed as he caught sight of the crimson-colored Katisha. The butterflies panicked and frank frantically scattered in all directions. You can't escape, screeched the crow to Katisha. Katisha, I'm coming to the rescue, said Clara. Clara, be careful, screamed Cornelius. Plucking up her courage, Clara flicked her wings at the crow. Catch me if you can, you scalawag, she taunted. Then Clara curved down and ducked into a came camellia bush. Look at there. She matches the same color. I'll bet the crow's not going to be able to find her. The crow became confused and forgot about Katisha. He cocked his head and pecked in the petals, but Clara, the cream-colored butterfly, lay camouflaged behind a curtain of cream-colored camellias. That's curious, complained the crestfallen crow. I was confident I could capture a succulent snack. Do you see her anywhere? She is very hard to find. Look at, she is sitting on a petal. She looks just like a petal down here. The coast is clear, Cornelia shouted. The crisis is over. Congratulations, Clara, Clara complimented the other butterflies. Clara, you're so clever, cried the shocked Katisha. I could never camouflage myself like you. I'm too colorful. I was crazy to scoff at your cream color. It's incredible. And cute, too, declared Cornelius. Oh, she's seeing the light. She sees how, how maybe it could be not just plain cream. Cornelius clapped his wings. Listen carefully, he commanded. That crow is a scoundrel. Let's cling close to Clara. Clara can stop him from catching us. Clara is so capable and courageous. Clara is lucky to be cream colored, said Patricia. The end. Look at all those pretty butterflies.